It's the second round of the ATB Financial Classic here in Calgary, Alberta, and I'm here with Izzy by Siegel, and Izzy shot one under par today, 70. Izzy, you must be very happy with the way you played today. Oh, I was very happy. I mean, it's uh, the wind started two on the back nine, so, um, but uh, really, I uh, just was happy I could just kind of try to repeat those processes and those routines and try to do my best. Now, you had it to uh, three under par at one point on your round today, and you made four birdies. Uh, tell us a little bit about what the emotions and what you're going through out on the golf course. Um, it was just uh, a lot of fun. I mean, today I think the the greens in the morning had a little bit of moisture, so I was able to, hit, you know, my ball was staying on the green a little bit better. So, um, so it was just nice to have a few putts go in, and uh, just really a blessing because I just, you know, came out here today again, just like yesterday, uh, just trying to do my best and see what happens. Now, what's been the highlight of the week uh, so far for you? You mentioned yesterday the Pro-Am was extremely fun. Tell us a little bit about the golf side of things in terms of your game. Yeah, um, uh, just had today, it was funny, uh, um, one of my best shots, it was like a five iron shot out of the rough, you know, on a par five, just to lay up. So, you know, those are shots, you know, I've had to kind of invent some shots, even yesterday on 18. I had like a downhill chip shot that I had to play like a little, um, you know, toe, stub type shot so so just kind of using a little bit of imagination has been really a lot of fun and um, you know I'm looking forward to trying again next week. Now what will you take out of this week in terms of learning experiences? Um, just that I mean everybody was just so wonderful and um, you know I couldn't have asked just you know I had a great pairing and um, everybody's just made me feel so at home and um, you know I just take that uh, I'm just really blessed to be here and have that opportunity and have open arms. Now, I didn't ask you this, and I've been meaning to ask you ask you this all week. Your husband's here caddying for you. Does that make it more comfortable for you on the golf course? Oh, definitely. I mean, he, he knows me better than I know myself, but I was just thankful he made it around and didn't re-rupture his Achilles because he only had surgery um, back in February, and I don't think his doctor doctor wants him to be walking around like this, but, but he's tough, and, um, you know, it's really fun to have him here. And last question, I asked you earlier about the significance of your of the flower on your hat. You wear it every day. It's sort of like your moniker, and it, it ties into your husband. Tell us about that. Yeah, well, f um, my husband uh, sent me flowers in 2003 while I was playing on the Future Store, and um, I finished second that week and had it on my hat, and then he sent to me a few more weeks after that. So the girls started kind of uh, telling me it was my thing, and so that's how it's been for the past seven years. And, um, you know, we also love Hawaii. We honeymoon there, and we've had an anniversaries there so that's kind of why it's it's there also that's great well we'll look for the flower next week in saskatoon and uh congratulations well played this week and uh, hopefully even better next week thank you so much scott appreciate it